right, guys, let's uh, let's let's see, let's see what we can do. He called. He said, um, oh, what the hell are you even saying, you stupid country yet? I guess we have no choice but to somehow find out for ourselves. Basically, yeah, he slips it back. He just puts it right back in the kitchen where he found it. Well, well, not so much found it, but where he got it from. Yep. Yeah, that too. Panic talk action. Shut up! That's impossible! Nonsense! Unforgivable! I don't know, I don't know, I don't know! Paris Hilton! Shut up! That's impossible! Nonsense! Unforgivable! I don't know, I don't know, I don't know! Paris Hilton! Unforgivable! Shut up! Huh. That's impossible! Nonsense! <laughs> Unforgivable! I don't know, I don't know, I don't know! Well be! This is the end! That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad at all. I think this one was better than this. This one was better than the last game version of that. What are you saying? There's no way I'd hide anything in a place like that. Th that's clearly impossible. I mean, that's <laughs> inside the food. Impossible. That's what Fiaki and I thought. That's why we overlooked. So I fell for the meme, huh? But in fact, the only place you could hide the weapon was inside the food that couldn't be inspected. Out of all the dishes you prepared, the only one that could hide a weapon as long as an iron skewer is? The meat on the bone. What now? I'm using my right to remain silent. You have the right to remain silent. Here. Negalore, what's going on? So if we eat How are you? Tasty looking piece of meat and find the iron skewer inside, bullseye! Oh. Ah. Yeah, well, guys, if anybody's new, if anybody's new to watching this, anybody new to my channel, you're more than welcome to subscribe to my minute. channel. Just I will be streaming more Danga Rapa. Uh, goodbye, day. Despair, Wait, over the weekend, second, and time, as time. well as the rest of the games. What are you doing? Four. Hurry up and bring it over! Where did Monokuma where, go? Where, 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 where Mono, I'm right here. What do you mean? Where? Where? What are you talking about? He's eating the. I'm all 
already eating it. Ah, He's smashing the meat. Uh, wait, now that I think about it, that's pretty normal. Oh, oh what is this? So yummy. Damn it. That's my meat. Oh man, I can't eat, like I can't eat to say something like that's my meat. The taste brings me back to my days in the wild. This, this is bad. Seriously, this is really bad. My, my. There's something inside the meat. Look what Look at out. that. The murder weapon. Isn't that? Is that an iron skewer? Yes, it Check is. Check it out. The handle looks like it's made of bone. Pretty clever. The sword of destruction, encased in bone and sheathed in meat. It brought catastrophe until beyond. Well, I hope that doesn't happen for me. Dang it. Such a fantastic weapon from the ultimate chef. You're wrong. I'm not the killer. I'm not the kind of. Yeah, guys, any, anything major, anything key to the story, you all please me keep up. it to yourselves. You me up so you can blame um, this on me. We do have a um, hangout section for those who want to talk more about the game since you've probably played it more than me or beat the game. There's the link right there for that. If you're on if you're on a computer can, and it can actually click that link and join the hangout there. But if you're on the phone then that's you know that's a different story and you won't be able to do it. That's for that. I'm definitely trying to have a, to as much anymore. as possible, roughly 99% uh, spoiler-free blind playthrough, since this is my first time playing this series. I guess we need to settle this, once and for all. To do that, we cool, need to cool. go over the entire incident from cool, the cool, end cool. and make everything clear. Too cool for school. <sighs> oh, this is the um the closing argument. So we need to do it. My throb is your th throb is chesting? What? <laughs> Did you mean your chest is throbbing? Basically the same concept, but you know, in a different, fit in a different format. It's basically what the game is trying to tell me. Time limit games, but this one's not that bad. At least it's you know, at least at least the you know the. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I, I, I know how the hell. I, I was I was just putting them all in in the spots to see if any of any of them were right. I just was just kind of getting frustrated. I was just let me just pick, let me just do them one at a time and see what happens. Yeah, that's all. I, I I know I gotta get used to it. It's just I think the other one was just more simply didn't take too much time.
Uh, um, ah, crap. Everything that happened in this right. case. Let's try Hello, Skate. Cooks. Hello, Tony. Right How are stuck. you? Welcome to my stream. Thank you for your viewership. Yakia had us gather in the dining hall at the old building near the hotel. He was extra cautious about a murder occurring that night because of a threatening letter he received. Again, anybody new to my channel. Therefore, he more than welcome to subscribe to my channel. I will be streaming more of the Danganronpa games. This is a, this is a blind playthrough series for me. I'm loving the game. I got hooked off the first of game, so I um, definitely am looking forward to uh, playing more of the Danganronpa hype train. Which nearly kept the power usage. Additionally, they prepared something else that would activate at 11:30 p.m. Thanks for your subscription, the air uh, in the office okay. in Appreciate it. They had already set the timers. For Thanks to the irons maxing out the power usage. The breaker was tripped when the air conditioners kicked on. Since the windows in the old building were covered, the blackout plunged the dining hall into total darkness. But when that happened, Biakia took out a specific item that he brought in his case. That item? was the night vision goggles. Yakia was so concerned about a murder. I need to get me some night vision goggles, son, straight up. When he put on his night vision goggles, Yakia witnessed a certain summer making a suspicious move. He saw Nagito guiding himself to the Oh, look, it's a, it's, a, it's a green, it's a green man. It's no longer a gray man, it's a green man. <laughs> That's right. Everything up to that point was all part of Nagito's plan. The murder warning to Byakuya, the source of the blackout, it was all Nagito. It's crazy. Nagato tried to do it, but While it turned out to be happening, someone else, the real the pervert, began making their move in the kitchen. The killer probably already knew about Nagito's plan. Oh, the gray so man's back. The blackout was coming. That's why the killer prepared all the items they would need to commit their crime in the dark beforehand. They needed a light source, which was provided by the portable stove in the kitchen. They needed a weapon, too. This had also been hidden in the kitchen beforehand. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> the long iron skewer used in the churrasco dish. The killer hid that inside that meat with the bone in it. <laughs> with the weapon and portable stove in hand, the killer stepped out into the hallway. First, they closed the fire door in the hallway so their light source wouldn't peek toward the dining room. Then, guided by the light, the That's funny, it says own and grabbed a specific item. Creek. <laughs> That's right. Swift. A tablecloth to block the blood splatter. I love these comic book uh, spots, guys. With like, this, for real. the killer finished their preparations and snuck under the floorboards through the secret passage. <laughs> they probably turned off the portable cooking stove at that point. Or left it near the entrance of the door. 
The floor in the dining hall is full of gaps, so there's no way they could have safely held a light source. But thanks to the glowing mark they painted earlier, the killer was able to get beneath the table. Under the table, Byakuya found the knife that had been hidden there. If only he had retreated, he probably wouldn't have gotten killed. He had to retrieve that knife, and at that moment, the killer lurking beneath the floorboard stabbed straight up with the That's iron. That's crazy. Stick. That is crazy. Boy, really did it. The killer had been waiting in the dark for the moment when the glowing paint began to move. After they murdered Byakuya, the killer purposefully shouted from beneath the floorboards to make it seem like they were still in the dining hall. Afterward, they came out from underneath the floorboards and rushed Guys, back I really to the can't, kitchen. I can't believe you really... So it really kill kill Biaki like that. And then, after hiding the murder weapon in the kitchen, they rejoined the group as if nothing had happened. There's only one person who would have been able to commit this crime. Especially if that person is someone who'd think of an unexpected way to hide a weapon inside food. Oh, Isn't that right, Teru Teru Hanamura? Isn't that right, pervert? That's what happened. How about it? Did I get anything wrong? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> gray guy killed. It wasn't Teru, it was the gray guy. A mistake, I tell you. I would never, I would never kill anyone. Would never. <laughs> <laughs> it seems this is the end. No. Oh. So guys, wait. Why is he crying in the mid right here? But on the left, he's smiling. <laughs> oh, what was? I got a B. Okay. Got 83 coins. More life. 